Hey, Kara Gott Warner, editor of Creative Knitting Magazine. And today I want to talk about a really great new product from Premier Yarns, and it's called Starbella Strata. This is a ball of the Strata right here in front of me. And this cowl that I'm wearing is actually made with the Strata, and I made it in under a minute, and I'm not kidding you. So if you're pressed for time during this busy holiday season, this is the perfect solution. So sit back and let's get started because I'm going to show you how to make this eye-catching cowl. Okay, so let's get started making this really cute cowl. Here's another example of it right in front of me in another colorway. So um, with one ball of strata, you can make two cowls. So what you need is a scissor and a ball of strata, and that's all you need to get started. So what we're going to do is we're going to start with, to make this, we need three yards, okay? So I'm just going to pull out some of this. And I measure my yards the old, um, let's call it the garment center way. <laughs> so if you were to hold a fabric or a length of yarn, like from your nose out, straight, uh, uh, straighten your, your arm, that's about a yard, give or take, you know? I mean. We're, we're kind of approximating here, so that'll work. So let's do that again. So we need two, and then a third. Third time. What do they, what do they say, third, third time's a charm? Anyway, so take this, this scissor and just, just cut, cut that two right, right there. And now this is where the fun part begins. Well, actually, but this is before the fun part begins. What we're going to do is now we have this Three, these three yards, and now we're going to cut them into um, one yard length. So I just kind of measure it out again, like like so. So there's one yard. Or if you really want to get super picky, you can measure it out with a tape measure. It's totally up to you, but this is totally my preference <laughs> because it's it's so much more fun and it's a lot easier. So you have these three pieces, okay, and this is where the fun part begins because now we've got three lengths and we take one of the pieces and see how I'm kind of opening this up? Okay, and then I'm going to kind of work my way through and stretch as I go. And it's, you'll see it's so, so easy. See how that opens up? This is, this is really cool stuff. So I'm gonna keep on going and keep on going and so now I'm going to do this. This is the fun part. I love doing this. It's a great way to take out and get out your stress, right? Um, not really. Just kidding. So there's one ringlet. I call these my little ringlets, okay? So there's ringlet number one. Now we're going to take our next strip, start to open that baby up, and then stretch away. It's so easy. And it might be fun if you were to time yourself just to see how many of these you can do, how many cows you can make, because seriously, um, it's so quick. Okay, so there's ringlet two, and then our final. And again, just so you know, I'm making the cowl that I'm wearing. And you can get two cowls like this out of one ball of the Starbella Strata. So I'm stretching that out. Then what we want to do is, and you can kind of fudge this or um, eye it, um, another piece that's about 16 inches or so, so I'm going to guess that's around 16 inches, but it's, it's pretty rough. And then you're going to cut. And now you're going to open it up once again. So just do as we did before and stretch that open. And now, for this particular ringlet, we're going to actually cut this open. So cut at one end, just like that. So now it's, it's one long piece, because that's our tie. That's our tie right here. So we take all of our ringlets, take them, take them together, okay? And then take your tie that you just created and put that through the opening. So really what you're, what's happening here is like it's a little ruched 
gathered kind of a look. And you're going to tie, tie that together and then make a bow. Or you could just tie another knot and it could just be sort of like a decorative looking tie that's just knotted, knotted twice. And that's it. I just made another, another cowl. Look how cool that is. This is the coolest thing. Here it is in another color, the one I'm wearing. Anyway, let me just put this on so you can see how cool this looks. That is the coolest thing, isn't it? So um, this is another idea. I just kind of played with it um, before I did this video. This is a piece of the strata, and all I did was kind of pull little bits of it. So I'll show you. It looks almost like a, um, like a, a ruffled scarf is what this looks like. So that's another idea. So I'm going to just cut a little piece of it, and I'll show you what I mean. So here it is in its natural, natural state, and I just sort of delicately pull out like this, and then work a couple inches down, and then pull it out again. And this is so easy to just play with, because you have nothing to lose. You have nothing to lose at all. There's no knitting involved. You don't need a crochet hook. You just need your hands and a scissor and your imagination. And that's basically it. So if you want to find out more about this exciting new product, which is available right now during the holiday season on anniescatalog.com, go ahead and grab yourself a bunch of these balls of um, strata and get busy making your gifts. Look at that. Isn't that the coolest thing? That is just fun stuff. Let's see how that looks. Here we go. You get the idea. You get the idea. So hop on over to anniescatalog.com so you can see this, uh, the full range of colors for this product. And be sure to stop by splendidsticks.com, which is my editor's blog. And feel free to leave your comments and your feedback. I'd love to hear from you. So happy holidays and have fun.